Snipe Squad, what is going on? Back again, it is your boy Sniper, Joan Joan, and I am back with another video for ya, hey top. What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Man, I'm excited because today we have a very special video. Now I know I say that a lot of times, but this time I really mean it, this video is special. We have Reebok in the building today and they sent over one of the best collaborations I think of the entire year. Now I know a lot of times I get stuff to unbox on this channel, but I've never ever in my entire YouTube history, I've never been able to unbox something that really brings me to this point and the packaging it comes in might be better than anything I've ever unboxed on the channel since it started. So if you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe because we grinded for 100K this year and you already know we're getting close. Also guys, right now as we speak, only 30% of the people that watch the videos are subscribed. So if that's you, I'm gonna leave you to go ahead and hit that sub button and be a part of the 100K, the Plaque Squad, Plaque coming in this year. Also guys, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both of those will be linked down below. But back to the point that's at hand, okay? We got one of the best presentations I've ever been sent and I'm excited to get into it. So without interruption, Let's get into it. So Reebok is collaborating with the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers and they have created this amazing concept and I've been chosen to be able to unbox this with you guys and I'm very, very excited about this. Now growing up, I was a huge Power Rangers fan and on top of that, to be able to work with Reebok has been amazing and I have worked with Reebok before in the past, so this is just another amazing video we were able to put together. So it's six pair of shoes that they sent me over to unbox. So hopefully y'all ready because I'm about to go through each and every last one of these. Some of these I couldn't wait for it. and some I'm not gonna lie Reebok put me on to so I'm excited to open these boxes up so as I grab the first box over here to my left you will see a leg okay and I know you're thinking like snipe what what kind of box is this well very quickly it is six boxes and once I build them up they make a Megazord any of my Power Rangers friends out there you know a Megazord is basically when the main uh, Power Rangers combine themselves and make that main formation and make like that unstoppable robot that is a Megazord so each box is in a different part of the Megazord and we can actually build this up to make an actual Megazord with the boxes they sent over which is crazy the first shoe we have I'm gonna open this up here I haven't opened these up yet but the packaging on here is fire it says welcome humans look at the box man so it says welcome humans when you open this up first shoe is the Reebok Zig Kinetica 2 and this one I have I have not seen too many videos or too many photos of this shoe, but one thing that caught my attention right off the back is, look at the outer sole, bro. Don't that look like Boost right there? Don't that look like, hey, I ain't gonna hold, that looks like Boost right there, which automatically makes me think that this shoe is probably pretty comfortable. Now, looking at this shoe, it definitely has to be like one of those shoes that's more on the comfort side, more on like the chill side. I personally probably wouldn't wear this one with a fit. This one would probably go like with a lot more sweatsuits, jogging suits. And another cool part about it is this green Reebok logo kind of throws it off a little bit because there's no green on the entire shoe, so it sticks out pretty quickly. If you look at that Reebok logo, that definitely looks kind of like out of nowhere, but I do love small pieces like that that just, I don't know, pop out. It also has Zig right there on the back. It also says power or Reebok on the tongue between the laces. This is my first time seeing this shoe in hand. It looks way better than the photos. And I think the biggest takeaway from this colorway is how light it is. It has a lot of Power Rangers reminiscence going throughout the entire upper as well. Let's see what else they sent your boy over, man. I'm excited to check out the entire package. As I told y'all, this is probably the best packaging I've ever gotten. This is the biggest box coming in right here. Oh my goodness, we get the fan favorite. This is without a doubt, probably the best shoe on the Reebok line. Something that we all are accustomed to, something that we all know and love, and that is of course the Reebok Question Mid. Now this shoe, without a doubt, is probably gonna be the best in the pack, and without even having to say it, it probably is the best shoe, or at least my favorite shoe, in the entire Reebok arsenal. I love the Question Mid, I love Allen Iverson, one of my favorite players to ever play the game. So a lot of people don't know that Power Rangers originally was an anime. I know a lot of people watch anime. Me, myself, I don't really watch it too much, but this sneaker definitely has me thinking about the anime version because you can see a lot of anime type details. On the ankle of the shoe, you can see like the anime drawings right here on the ankle. You also get like the anime type designs on the side panel of the shoe and even the bottom midsole. Check out the words that you see right here on the side panel of the shoe. This is 
definitely a direct impact on anime. One thing that I kind of love right off the bat is like the mismatched toe box that this shoe has. Shout out to Reebok because they also did send me the Reebok Double Cross. And if y'all remember that one, that one was like a classic Philadelphia 76ers colorway. And it also had the mismatched toe box. So it kind of gave me an idea of that too. All right, I'm gonna grab, is this is an arm? I don't know if this is an arm or a leg. I think this is an arm. I think it's an arm. We're gonna open these up was inside we have the Reebok Club C Legacy now this has premium type vibes all throughout the entire shoe now as you can see the aesthetic uh the material that's on this and even the overall first look this strikes me as more of a premium look this is something I will wear like more in an upscale event I probably wouldn't wear this for anything that's streetwear related because I don't think that it will blend I do believe that this shoe has its time in place one thing I do like about it is the translucent outer sole it's pretty cool once again I think they talked about once again I love the fact that they hinted on the anime when you look at the collar of the shoe right here on the side i want to check out the other shoe to see if there's any big differences between the two if they decided to do anything differently so just like the first shoe they decided to put the power rangers logo right here on the tongue and on a separate tongue they decided to go with more of the power rangers bowl all right guys so we three sneakers down and we got three more to go so i'm already excited we've seen three these three are kind of smooth though i feel like every shoe gives us a different vibe okay 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 we got the head Head of the Megazord, which kind of makes me think maybe this one is hitting a little bit more than the others. I still like the Question Mid more than all the other ones, man. I just feel like that one right there is just like a hometown favorite. We have, we have the Reebok FS High. Now, without a doubt, this shoe is undoubtedly completely different than every shoe I didn't show y'all so far. So this shoe gives me like the back to the future. This gives me back to the future vibes. This gives me like a more futuristic style. Even look at the back, how the back heel is like all the way drug out with like this diamond S type feel to it. Another cool fact about this shoe, this is the first shoe that we will be talking about today from this Power Rangers Reebok collab that does not have any shoe strings at all. The entire upper is 100% Velcro. You get a huge strap going over the forefront of the shoe. And then last but not least, you get two minor straps over the top of the shoe. This one is definitely futuristic. I'm not gonna lie. This one is a great concept. This is a concept sneaker. Don't really know if it will actually translate over to like the streetwear brand that I like, but the concept of Power Rangers and the FS High, I think it was done amazingly. Solid though, I'm not gonna lie, solid. I like the concept idea. The concept idea is still good. We got two more. Let's get into these last two, man, I'm excited. Ah, now we have another leg, I believe, okay? Let's open these up and see what's inside. We have, I don't know, man. I think we have my second favorite shoe we just picked up. This is the Reebok Nano X1. This undoubtedly probably has to be my second favorite shoe behind the Reebok question mid i mean this shoe is solid all black that you really can't go wrong on you see the silver coming up on the mid so you also get like these dope amazing colors around the entire shoe you get a little bit of green highlighted you once again get that yellow bolt for the power rangers as we all know it and then on the back it's like we got this nice collective colors almost like galaxy type vibes that you would get on the back heel of the shoe you also get like this cool glimpse of color of this stripe going down the back heel i want to go back in the box to make sure that this shoe is the same on the opposite end, and it is. And checking out the outer show, you get a little bit of glitter, and then you get that same material that looks like it's very comfy to wear on the forefront of the shoe too. So not only is it fashionable, but it also looks like it's pretty comfy. It also has a little bit of the anime writing on the bottom heel of the shoe too, but this one is definitely my second favorite out of the pack, okay? I'm going with the Nano X1. This one was, was a nice shoe, Reebok. Y'all did y'all thing on this pair right here. This is fire. And last, but certainly not least, we got the yellow box that seems bright, okay? I'm not sure what's in it, but hopefully we end it off on a good foot. As I open this up, I have no idea what can be inside of this. I think the entire package has been amazing. And like I said, the presentation is easily the best. And just like the box, we have a bright yellow pair of Reebok Club C's. Now this is just like the blue pair, but it's a little bit different because it's a little bit less depth and less effect to this. Even though it's a basically clear cut canvas, there is a little bit of stigma to it. So you get this bright yellow that surrounds the entire shoe, but it's another dark yellow that's underneath. And it's like a two-tone type look, but it's still one solid color. You see the huge logo on the side panel as we flip around you get the number five here and then you get a little bit more of the anime writing going on the side let me pull out the next one to see what we're looking like and whoo, these are bright 
This shoe, I ain't gonna hold you. If you were to pick any shoe out of this entire lineup because you wanted to flex, because you wanted to stunt, or if you wanted a little bit more attention to your feet, this is the one you need to go towards. It's almost nearly impossible for you to put on a pair of these and to not have people turn heads. I do think, I like the wow factor. I like the fact that they decided to go with a more dominant bright color because like I said, it do add a splash of touch to the entire package. Hey guys, I am super thankful right now that Reebok has allowed me to give y'all this Power Rangers collaboration and a lot of these shoes are pretty dope. I want y'all to comment and let me know which shoes out of this pack are you feeling the most and which ones could you let slide. This collaboration will be available soon but make sure you follow me over on instagram if you want to see how each and every last individual box becomes one megazord for any more information on the reebok power rangers collab man just make sure you stay tuned to the videos because i will be updating you guys on a release date and where you can find it until next time man it is your boy sniper jones i would like to thank y'all for yet another video i will see y'all in the next one you know i cannot leave without saying everybody want to be famous but we'll be putting in that work though snipe squad i love y'all dream big